There it is, folks. 2022 Dynamax Force HD 34KD. A beautiful machine. This has the blackout package. Give us the American Racing blackout wheels, black mirrors, black dipped out grill, Dynamax traditional fogs. So that's a 7.7 liter Detroit diesel. It has the motor, Allison transmission, Allison 6P. I think it's a it's a 3200. Oh no, M2 106 chassis. Kind of a little heavier duty chassis. Um, we got twin saddle tanks, 50 gallons a piece. Eight or 10 gallon DEF tank. Bilstein shocks, Dynamax ads. Mm. I'm just going to take you on a little tour of this today. It has a 20,000 pound tow rating. Comes with a way safe. We got our side view cameras. We got four cameras on this guy, two backs and two sides. Here's our uh, flat screen sound bar. You can tie your Bluetooth to it to uh, get radio out of your phone. Our first storage is a pass through. Turn the lights on here. We go inside. We'll just turn that on. The masters on and cargo porch. And awning light. Now we got our, our rope light and our porch light on. Cargo lights on, so this one's a half pass. We got power up there. That's our way safe. We have the Truma Aqua Go. That's a tankless hot water heater. Instant and tankless. There's our. I think that's an air chuck. Uh, we have a couple of it is, yeah. We got comes with an air chuck with an air nozzle. We have uh, a chuck in the system. Super C's have uh, air suspension and air brakes, so it has an onboard air compressor. Another big rotocast storage compartment. This is, uh, I think I mentioned the 34 KD, so this is the 36 total length. That's our black and gray. And another half pass through, 50 amp service. It comes with a little starter kit. Um, this is for sale, it is available. Dog bone. There's our uh, LP Quick Connect. This paint um, is absolutely fabulous. So, Dynamax will paint this, of course, then they'll cut and buff and wet sand it to take all that orange peel away. And it's absolutely smooth as silk. Um, it's just an amazing, amazing paint job. So this is all paint. There's no vinyl anywhere on the coach. Um, our motor horsepower and torque is right there. Like I said, it's a 20,000 pound tow rating and that is gonna be right there seven pin of course nice big LED backup lights docking lights Got some docking lights up top some running lights this is the main slide awning toppers fiberglass curb roof of course this one has a vented washer and dryer combo you know, propane. Yeah, that's our nice wet bay right here. This has a macerator. If you're not familiar with the macerator, <clears throat> essentially it's a black tank grinder for the solids in the black tank. And then it uh, pumps it through this hose. Standard uh, uh, adapters for our, our park sewers. Or you can 
we can use something different. This actually has an end where this one right here. So this goes on and then you can pump it through a garden hose if you want, like so. Um, tanks are heated, of course. This whole area is heated um, by the furnace, so we're safe here. We have an outside shower, our whole house water filter, and there's our uh, macerator pump, and then our cargo porch light, uh, security light on our side, dryer side, water pump and gen start and stop all right there. And more, and then we got some, all of our drains are right there. Under here is going to be our 8,000 watt diesel generator by Onan and Cummins. And then on the side of that's our hydraulics for our levelers. Four big hydraulic levelers underneath here to level it all up. There's our uh, power cord reel. And a little bit of a pass through compartment. And then uh, this guy, these are blue, so those are lithium. Two big lithium batteries, a couple of house chassis batteries, excuse me, a couple disconnects, but all of our kind of our, all our oh yeah, and then the, uh, the slide motor is right there, and then the air chuck is right here. So you can air your tires off, or bike tires, or whatever. See the mechanism for the slide is quite robust, certainly not a... Uh, a cheap system. There's our big inverter charger, all of our electronics, and uh, what do we got there? Some, that's go power, some other adapter module, the transfer switches in there too. That's one side view camera. This coach is just gorgeous. Probably take a look at this guy. Let's unwrap this. My name is Tony, by the way. You can reach me at 616-375-3355 if you have interest in this one or others. I have, a, well, I have a big old building here that's got uh, mostly towables, but we have about 40 motorhomes in stock. So we're getting there. Let's see what this Detroit looks like. Yeah, there it is. See those air horns sticking out the top. Cool stuff. Take a look at what, how we get in this beast. First, I want to point out that black, engine black heater plug right there. Uh, but these guys, what we have here is air seats. So these keep you nice and comfortable going down the road. It's a chassis disconnect right here that would turn the power off to the chassis side. Up here we have our cruise control and wipers. You can see we have 213 miles on this guy is all. There's our Alice in transmission. This big screen shows both of our blink or side views and then two backups, one horizon, one hitch. This guy here is my tire pressure monitor and then my uh, mobile eye collision avoidance system, which is right here. We have a full navigation here. Um, and that's based on your coach size and specifics that you can plug in there. A couple USB inputs. Yeah, the, uh, uh, battery, whoops, sorry. Our engine brakes. Let's focus in here. I think that's our locker for a rear end, a battery boost, and a uh, option. I don't think anything's being used. Maybe the fogs. I'd have to check. No, nope, fogs are right here. And then uh, just so I can dump our bags on the back. We have the JBL premium sound in this guy. And then these seats also swivel. Uh, before I get to the cab, in here are some controls. I can turn my porch and my cargo lights on. I can start my gen and stop it. Some lights for the cab. 
and then master lights on and off so you can control everything from here the passenger seat is also air of course um, if you haven't seen the firefly system this is a really cool system um, that uh, is used to control really most of the, the coach uh, systems um, this is our home screen it's a uh, master lights off and on this is my compartment temps my uh, inside front and rear zone and then my tank compartment and my exterior temperature so it's great to kind of monitor you know how cold things are getting if you get in between seasons water pump and then all of our uh, percentages and then our house uh, voltage and our chassis voltage um, we do have automatic gen start so you can set that to uh, to turn on with ac call or a voltage call low voltage call it'll start your generator automatically we can dim all of our lights so it's nice and get them you know nice and lower instead of so bright we have a night mode and a day mode that's kind of pre-programmed lights uh, to make it very easy to get everything kind of dialed in uh, and my zones i have a two zone uh, system two acs um, they will obviously cool but then they'll also heat they have two heat pumps there's our furnace control and then this auto function is really cool you just set it to auto set a temperature and, and it'll just do what it needs to do um, there's my slide controls and my awning and my levelers full auto levelers of course um, so it's pretty cool that's the system is, is quite nice um, you can like i said download an app for this it's called the mira app i believe and um yeah it's super easy You'll link it right in, and then you can tr control your coach right from your smartphone. Right above this, we do have an um, in-motion satellite on the coach. Uh, that is that control. And then uh, let's take a look at this guy. We haven't seen this, really. So this is feature or uh, optioned with theater seats. Those are power. Each end is power. Um, it goes pretty much lace flat. We'll open this up. It's heated and it is massaging so these are by villa in my opinion the, the most comfortable theater seat that i carry at least um, even from the integras i think this is a win uh, really nice dinette dream dinette so that'll convert into a bed nice and easy uh, but dynamax has done a great job offering storage underneath both of these you simply lift them up there's power underneath that one two seat belts there two seat belts on our theater seating and then um, two of course up front this is the bunk over the cab there's a privacy curtain there's a ladder and a guard so you don't fall out and then of course that pad would just come forward and lay flat sound bar there's our tv um, it's in the kitchen but they do a good job and they can still they give you the storage behind them Nice, nicely finished off and carpeted, so it's not wasted space. I'll open the cabinets a little bit, and this is a nice big uh, microwave convection. And gas range, three drawers, a couple more, and an extension. Real nice um, stainless steel one sink with toppers, nice faucet. We option this with a Norcold uh, two-way. So this is gas and electric for a drayer. It's better for boondocking, pretty good size. Um, it has both um, day and night shades on every window. Super nice, you got some power up there and then more storage, real deep storage here. Um, controls here the lights night mode day mode there too which is cool and then we're going to come into the separate uh, medicine cabinet i'm tony nice to meet you <laughs> um, so we have a sink there we'll have our stacked washer and dryer here it's hard to get an angle here without going into the bed nope and then inside is my big shower with that uh, over thing and then a porcelain toilet and max air fan 
but we're closing down. King bed. That's your standard wireless chargers on each side with with power. And that's on both sides. And this is a uh, one of those uh, adjustable beds. Uh, not really a, it's like a select comfort. And we got big dinette here. Everything is cedar lined in the drawers and in the wardrobe. And there's space on this one. Right there, big space to put stuff. Yeah. Nice big deep drawers. And there's another one. You got some lights on in there too. And then there's more controls for your, um, you can do all the masters just the front off and on. That's cool. And then they'll leave the day ones on or back ones for you. There. So that is our Dynamax 4 34KD. Again, my name's Tony. And if you're interested uh, in, one, in this one or, or even something else, Give me a call. I'd be happy to, to assist you. Thanks again for watching. Bye-bye.